Welcome to our video on PHP file naming conventions. Today we're tackling a question that many developers ponder. Is there a standard way to name PHP files that primarily contain HTML with a bit of PHP? Should you go with myfileexample.php, myfileexample.php, or perhaps myfileexample.php? Let's explore this topic together. Welcome back guys to another technical help question. I'll be going through the question, the answers, and hoping to help find that answer. Guys, I hope you stay crazy just a little bit like me and get through and work to the solution. Now let's get started. When naming PHP files, it's important to follow conventions that enhance readability and maintainability. Let's explore some common practices. One popular convention is to use hyphens to separate words. For example, myfileexample.php is clear and easy to read. Another option is camel case, like myfileexample.php. This style is often used in programming, but can be less readable for longer names. Some developers prefer all lowercase letters, such as myfileexample.php. While this is simple, it can reduce clarity. In summary, using hyphens is generally the best practice for naming PHP files that contain HTML and PHP code. It strikes a balance between readability and convention. Let's now look at a user-suggested answer. When naming PHP files, it's recommended to follow the PSR4 standard, which uses a directory structure to represent namespaces. This helps in organizing your code effectively. For object-oriented programming, Using an autoloader can simplify code management. It allows you to automatically load classes without manual includes. To link class names to file paths, a simple approach is to append .php to the class name. This makes it easy to locate the corresponding file. Let's now look at another user-suggested answer. For naming PHP files, it's recommended to use underscores, like myfileexample.php. This is a convention used by frameworks like CodeIgniter for view files. Using dashes can cause issues in some IDEs or text editors, where double-clicking may not select the entire file name. Underscores generally allow for better selection. Let's now look at another user-suggested answer. There's no strict convention for naming PHP files, but consistency within your project is key. It's recommended to use camel case for your file names. Let's now look at another user suggested answer. When naming PHP files, consider two main conventions, 
the framework you're using in PSR4. Ideally, these should align. The key takeaway is consistency. Once you choose a naming convention, stick with it throughout your project. Inconsistent naming can lead to confusion whether it's files, classes, or methods, so be consistent. Let's now look at another user-suggested answer. When naming PHP files, there's no strict rule. You can create your own naming convention based on the file's purpose. For example, if a PHP file only displays HTML, you might name it myfileview.php. If it handles database operations, consider myfileDB.php. Feel free to use similar naming patterns for functions and other specifications. And that's it. I hope that that's helped find the solution that you're looking for. And if it did, please, I'd appreciate it if you hit the subscribe button. Every time you hit it, it really helps. Now, I'll see you next time. Next time you need some technical help. And until then, have a good one.